Good Thursday evening to you. Richard Scott here for the forecast update. As we head into the weekend, some changes coming up in your weather. We've got some rain between now and then, and then the possibility of some strong storms coming up on Monday. So here's a look at the radar. We're coming up on 10 o'clock on this Thursday night. Most of the rain south of Highway 80. Again, a couple of showers north of there. This activity will build northward through tonight. 47 at Tuscaloosa. That's not far from our low. We'll bottom off somewhere in the low to mid 40s overnight with a cloudy sky. Rain at times. Currently 46 in Summerton. All dry there for now, but again, rain will move in later tonight. 40s all across central Alabama. Low to mid 40s. Upper 40s for west Alabama. Notice the showers, mainly the heavier rain over portions of southeast Alabama. That's where that will stay for tonight. And tomorrow, good chance for showers at about any time. And keep in mind, it will not rain all day. The core of the cold air up north for now, we're just kind of cool down here in the southeast. And uh, cool is a relative term for this time of the year. Uh, I do expect a warmer trend coming up for at least the latter half of the weekend. 60s will return. So, again, for the rest of tonight, showers will be possible tomorrow morning. Scattered showers, heavy rain southeast. And uh, as we go into the afternoon, there may be a little bit of an increase in shower activity for West Alabama. That moves on to the east pretty quickly. By 530, that will be over central Alabama. A lot of folks asking about the West Alabama Christmas Parade Friday evening. I think there could be still some drizzle, maybe even some light showers nearby, but the heavier stuff will be off to the east by Friday evening. Saturday morning, getting a couple of showers early in the day. Skies mostly cloudy. I do think we'll see some clearing by mid-afternoon. West Alabama Christmas Parade forecast again, 5 o'clock, uh, 5 or 5.15, I think, is the tree lighting ceremony. And then after that is the parade at 6.30. If you're going to be in downtown Tuscaloosa, temperatures around 50. Uh, you see the rain icon in there. That's for a few light showers. I don't expect anything overly heavy during parade time. I would take the umbrella, though, to be safe. The weekend's going to be just fine, no problems at all. Then we'll go into Monday, a very dynamically driven storm system coming in. Uh, some wind shear, some unstable air will be possible with this event. There could be some severe thunderstorms across Alabama. I think all modes of severe weather will be possible. Now understand, this could change. This is a very early look at what could happen for Monday. We're talking about midday through midnight. So basically Monday noon through midnight Monday night. All modes of severe weather will be possible. Again, this could change. The threat could increase or decrease. So keep checking back with us. We do get closer to this event. Here's your seven-day weekend. No problems at all. We got temperatures in the low 60s on Saturday. Could reach the mid-60s on Monday, or Sunday rather, then mid-70s on Monday. Very warm. You'll feel that mugginess out there. And then it turns sharply colder by Tuesday and Wednesday. Some of us could be in the 40s all day. And then we got a freeze coming up. Tuesday night and Wednesday night. 